It's been just over a week since three Wisconsin Girl Scouts and a mother were killed by a pickup truck while they cleaned up trash along a highway. The occupants of that truck were allegedly huffing before hitting the group. The driver now faces homicide and hit and run charges. And this weekend, Girl Scout troops across the country remember them. Fox 55's Abby Jackson has more. A moment of solidarity as Girl Scouts come together to remember some of their own and to sign cards to raise the spirits of a 10-year-old survivor. It was really sad that they were um, doing like a community project and that, that had to happen. For girls like Samantha Hall, it was a sign of respect, something she learned in Girl Scouts. It's really fun and you get to learn like how to be a young lady. Ruth Strasser with the Girl Scouts of Northern Indiana, Michiana, says it's never easy to explain tragedies to the girls. First and foremost, we care about their safety when they're doing these projects, and unfortunately, sometimes things just happen. And to the parents worried for their daughter's safety after the deadly crash, Strasser says these girls did everything right. All the things we've been doing is trying to talk to our girls and say, it's okay. The girls weren't doing anything wrong. They were doing something right. They just were in the wrong place at the wrong time. Now, in the spirit of Girl Scouts everywhere, they'll continue doing the good they set out to do. Since the girls just happened while they were doing a service project, we chose to do a service project, too. We're collecting items that are deal with a Thanksgiving dinner, you know, canned corn, green beans, we'll even take turkeys. The 10-year-old girl who survived was last said to be stable at the hospital. If you have cards you'd like to send to her or if you want to donate a canned good to the Girl Scouts, you can drop them off at their office.